Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Life is Strange. We're continuing from where we left off on so the last lame. episode. They don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Alright, so now you guys are kind of, now you guys are uh, caught up in what's going on. We're here to find shit and Apparently dirt on Logan Nathan. missed this poster. Safety first. Look for your lust, always use protection, and secure your future. Oof. Okay, that Okay, I gotta let this go through again. Alright. Come on, we've already been through this. Kate brings it. So room 111 is the magic number. 17, 18. Okay, so this is the right way. It's all good in the woods. Ugh, skunk weed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. Nah. <laughs> What's this? Don't be what? Don't be bullied. This just makes me think of Kate. If you're the victim of bullying, you are not alone. Come join a monthly support slash discussion group. That's cool. Yeah, if you're someone who gets bullied or has been bullied, reach out to people who can relate to you. Don't just don't just hide it. Talk to someone. It'll help. Trust me. What's this? The Prescotts rule this town. Okay, what what's Max? I say that here. This can only be Nathan's room. Okay, I could have guessed that. Oh. Bust the door, get in, rewind, door will be locked. I can't rewind, right? Now I need to find Nathan's phone. Or anything with clues. There we go. Perfect. I didn't mean to sleeve, like nothing happened. Uh, I saw a Joyce. I but really hope they were all consenting models. That's disturbing. Uh, camera. What's this? Certificate. It's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. If it wasn't such a dick, I would say it's cute. But that just seems kind of. That yeah. monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Wow. <sighs> Bastard. Mac, hey. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. Highly disturbing. That is so Chloe. Hey, asshole, we need to talk. Or I'm going to tell everybody what you did, and you're going to pay, motherfucker. Oh wait, there's more. Fuck. That is. Oh my god. Whoa. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. Whoa, okay. That's fucked up. Whale songs. Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Lamp? That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Yikes. This is very fucked up. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but... The guy has his own style. If he was as nice of a guy as his shots were, he'd be a way better person. This seems very off. Where's this where's this being projected from? Yes, I would be cool with having this high tech projector. Oh, book. I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts.
I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Yeah, it or Come on, it doesn't Max. Have... You're in the belly of the beast. Search everywhere. I am searching everywhere. I'm taking my time. These films all have a dark pattern. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Whoa. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A That's... gift from... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we'll shut the computer in a minute. I'll see this picture. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Yeah, I would too. Not gonna lie. Okay, now we can check the computer. Let's see what Nathan hides in here. Nathan is way into this party. Okay, uh, to sign. Victoria from Nathan. Hey, gorgeous, let me know what you're wearing to the Vortex uh, this week so I can wear something just as styling and expensive. <laughs> That's pretty egotistic and a little uh, controlling. Uh, <clears throat> I'm excited about going and I'm picking up some serious parte favors. <laughs> wow, that's fucking cliche. I even told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so we can uh, get Redfield Hassle if we're going to have an end of the world theme. Then let's <laughs> let's do do it on fucking point. <sighs> Now I remember why I hate you, and why Kate will get justice. Okay. Oh man, Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Uh, Nate, I know this has been a stressful week, and your mother and I are here to talk if you, if need be. Just make an appointment anytime. Your mother wants Doctor Bill to come out after uh, his book tour, but for now, let's stick to your prescriptions. I need you calm and quiet while my pan estates is being developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and I'm glad... Wait, oh, and I'll guide you into this room step by step, as my father did. It was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. Oh, don't worry about Blackwell. This shithole town is going to get... Uh, I meant... Uh, la, la, la. I meant ma. I can't fucking read today. Along with a fresh brand, I want you to be ready to take over when the moment is right. Don't fuck it up. Wow, what a bastard. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. Tudabim from Brazil. Oh, that's Portuguese. I have no idea how to pronounce that. If anybody knows, let me know. Uh, from Brazil, little brother. It's been so long since we've... Or since I've heard... I can't fucking read. So long since I've heard from you, so please let me know what's going on in your exciting, uh, <laughs> in your exciting life. I am not awake, so I can't English. I had a very rough night. Uh, exciting life at Blackwell. I brag to all my coworkers in the uh, Peace Corps that my talented bro Nate got a full scholarship to one of the best schools in the world, even though I can't always check my email or phone. Uh, please, 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 please send me some new photos of campus so I can live vicariously for your lens. I miss you and your pictures. And yes, mother told me you've been in trouble and father has been on your ass, but you have to either ignore him or stand up to him. You know I love dad, Nate, but I'm also a, I'm also enjoying halfway across the world because of him. He's a bully who inherited power, not wisdom, and the only way to win against one is to fight back. Don't let him change you into the uh into one just for the family legacy uh end of lecture you're at school so i just wanted to make sure you feel at home okay so maybe i kind of judged him a little too harshly okay well no he's still an asshole but he's kind of been groomed to be one uh, huh you know i don't know where to go with that Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Okay. Nathan, I'd like to apologize for the recent accusation. Your name and record speaks for itself. Sometimes students will use that to make their own name in Blackwell. Ah, of course. 
I know your father was upset while I have assured him that you would never bring him up into school. I don't want you to I don't want you to strive from school and I'm certain this matter will be settled by the end of the week. If you have any questions, you know I'm always available. Motherfucker. Alright. Well I I feel like that's everything. Oh no wait. Please, please, please. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Let's move the couch. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh, hello. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Alright, I think we're good to... Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Cool, now it's opened. And we are leaving! That went a little too well. I'm concerned now. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean and... Creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Fuck! What are you doing in my dorm? We're visiting one of the maids. You're such a nosy bitch, Max! Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho! <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. Nobody wins with a headbutt. You no. are so fucking dead! Get off me, bro! No, I'm gonna fucking stay out of it. He has a gun. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! He deserves every bit of this. I feel bad for him at first, but not anymore. Please! I feel bad for him, but not anymore. He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. I got a picture of him. And it was how much good. Of she is. But scary. I think a picture of him. Shit, man. This really hurts. Good. Fuck you. <laughs> Fucking deserve it. Damn, that was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So, where are you going? I better stick with you guys, just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Uh, not yet. Uh, so maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes. <laughs> you are. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. <laughs> he really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, 
Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. <laughs> yeah, we've already had one small town throw down today. Let's not have another one. A part of me wanted to stop Warren from beating the shit out of Nathan because of what I read and found out he is on so much medication. But at the end of the day, I don't feel bad for bullies. I don't care what your excuse is. I don't care what your home life is like. You have no right to take it out on someone else or anyone else for that matter. God, I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just... Think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might <laughs> even save you someday. About time. <laughs> I'm so going to hate you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Okay, we're walking. Huh. Yeah, wait, this is really, really fucked up. Where do we get a picture? What's this? This is where my nightmare started. Yeah, right up there. This is crazy. No worries, sign. Yeah, trust me, nobody's coming around here anytime soon. Those beached whales look so awful, but still so majestic. Is this one we can take a picture of? I may not know quantum speak, but there has to be an explanation. This is very messed up. Right. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. Oh. I got an achievement, but I didn't see what it was. Those beached whales look so awful, but still so majestic. Alright, so that's still the same. Oh, wait. Nope, okay. We're good. Alright. Frankie. There's a lot of stuff out here. Beer bottles. Garbage. Uh, I'm just going to look at this. I'm just going to cut it out, though, because I'm, I'm just curious. Behold, Frank's beer garden. Hmm, <laughs> beer garden. Take the trash out sometime, dude. I mean, okay, well, he technically did, but, you know, his dumpster right there. He could have thrown it out. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. Doggo food? Oh, fresh meat. So Pompadou must be okay. Good doggy. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. Oh, 
Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Yeah. Hardy Just boys. the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Uh, well. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I... Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Step the fuck back now! Papadou! You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Chloe! Oh, wow, 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 oh, wow, 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 wow. Oh no! Ho! Oh, ho! 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 I just shot a man and his dog. I killed Frank Bowers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it, it was self defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know, but we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. Oh my god. That, no. That's it. I don't, I don't know what Let's to say. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Um, that, 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 Jesus. that. Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. Really, She'll really. never forgive herself. Or forget this. And only I can change it. Oh. Oh. Ah, fuck it. Uh, I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna regret this. Ah! Oh, I feel like I should have gone back. Chloe, are you okay? I'm sorry, I, it, I keep seeing Frank dead. And I'm the one who killed him. Listen, you saved my life and yours. We have to keep going forward.
I'd better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Okay, gather info on a character by selecting the clues for each section. Let's I look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. I was reading that. Wait. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but I don't think he would hurt her. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. He does. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. I bet I could suss out some major clues in Frank's account book. If I could decipher the damn code names. Okay, we got that so let's go over here then. Yes! The there game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. <clears throat> That's it, Max. You locked it, dumbass. Okay, so it's not... Yeah. Okay, that's good to know. Let's try free... Okay, let's try 0058. Wrong thing. Let's start hacking. You locked it, dumbass. So it's not the one on the card. It's not... Okay, 9535. Bad code. Yep. Okay. Four four three six. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Five four three one. You locked it, dumbass. Let's find out what Nathan Prescott has been trying to hide. I had to intentionally lock the phone to override it. Ah. <laughs> That's just, okay. What's up, need the G? Okay. Cool. Uh, bitch, you sold me water, asshole. Calm down, bring it to me. Uh, bring it Ed. Stay away. Uh, pigs on the yes. beach. This is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. No time to charge me double, damn right. 
Have cash on you, no fucking around. Give me the address. I'll call you and give you exact directions. Drug dealer drama. Hey, you up, bro? No shit, what you need? <laughs> Peruvian flake. Why? Skittle acid. Wow, okay. You're paying night prices. Don't make me wait. God, Nathan. You're out of control. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Wow. No, Nathan. It's time for you to watch out. Asshole. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Wow, Nathan is really fucked in the head. Alright, so how much more do we have to go? This is it. Great. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Uh... Pff, wow, okay. Yep, another car David was tracking. Huh. Who else was David tracking here? Why the hell are you following these people? And to where? There's Nathan dealing to the kids right out in the open. That's definitely Chloe's car. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating, as usual. Okay, so that means one of these two plates is his. So let's get a look at some details here. Okay, so we got kind of gray siding and a busted tail light. Oh, there it is. That's his. Hmm. Who does this car belong to? Sierra X-Ray, Foxtrot Tango, November. I can't tell what that is. Is that Oscar or Delta? Okay, let's take a look. Nope, this is it. Now we're finally getting somewhere. There we go. Chloe, I, I need you to go online and help me decipher this. Chloe? Max. I actually killed somebody. Listen to me, Chloe. Chloe. Chloe, please listen. I know this is... Awful, but we're in it together, okay? I didn't have your back, and I let you down. Please don't cry. Max, I'm, I'm gonna go to the police after we find Rachel. I can't live keeping this a secret, and I don't want to be a teenage fugitive on the run, and, and dude, I swear I, I won't even mention you, okay? This is all me. Chloe, it was self-defense. I know you're hurting, but you have to just block out everything and keep moving forward. Rachel is waiting. <sighs> okay, you're right. Focus on Rachel. It's all about Rachel now. Okay. We will. And I know this week has been so weird and fucked up. But Chloe, this has to be our destiny. Or at least one of them. Let's just find out where this is all going to end, okay? For Rachel. For Kate. And for Frank. He was dragged into this bullshit too. That's my Chloe. Now let's be a lean, mean research team. You have to go online and help decipher these coordinates. Because... They might finally lead us to Rachel. Here we come, Rachel. Damn, this is getting heavy. This Thanks, is getting... Chloe. This is getting crazy. I suck. So 
So, this infamous party was the fourth. So, this infamous party was the fourth. Oh, wait, I think I get it. October 4th. Ah, here we go. I need to score ASAP. Um, okay. So, house calls. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot in the forest. Not much out there. Aha, there we go. Chloe, this is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. Oh. I'm shocked. Nah. Yeah, Prescott's Should a free bar in the woods. Call the police? Not Fuck yet. that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. I think she hears as much as she wants to hear. Hmm. No trespassing. Well, we're here, so get fucked. Holy shit, this is scary. I know, but we're here. Let's go find the best way in. Oof, got hiccups. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we need to get in that barn. It's clear they locked them ass. So Chloe and me actually killed somebody. What happens to us now? Well, that is a question we'll answer in the next episode. Because unfortunately, even though I'm also doing, you know, PC stuff now, I'm still majority console gamer. A lot of these games I can't play on my computer because A, I need to rebuy them, and B, I already have all my choices here. So that'd be very hard. I do plan to bring The Walking Dead back. I have the, season, the second season of The Walking Dead on my laptop, so I've got to play for season one again and redo all my choices. But that will be coming back uh, eventually in better quality. But now I need to find a way in. Shut up, Max. But with that said, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you haven't yet, consider subscribing. It really means a lot. Helps the channel grow. And make sure to turn notifications get a howl every time I upload a new video. Like I said, I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace, guys.